for How eight heads. You? I'm good. good. How are you? Good. Let's go sailing. Huh? Let's go sailing. All right, we are. <laughs> Looks like we're moving. <laughs> Doesn't it? Actually, I close my eyes. We're this wrong. is cute. Yes. Is this a little okay. boat? No, that's a. That's that's actually a houseboat, I think. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. Um, well, here we are on our little cruise, I guess. Right. Uh, uh, everybody's going to be asking you something. Diane, you uh, are an anthropologist as well as an actress? <laughs> well, I study men all the time, yes. You officially <laughs> studied men in University school. University of Washington, I did. And uh, what kind of men do you like particularly? All kinds. All kinds? Yeah, I love men. All right, let's talk about some of the men that you have loved or liked or had relationships with and you've studied. These, many of these you've just used as study vehicles, I'm sure. <laughs> Willie Nelson, for example. Oh, Willie's wonderful. Willie's... Uh, Willie's a sweetheart. He, he's a, a renegade and a bit of a rebel, and I like that in a man because he doesn't settle for anyone's answers but his own. Did you get a love scene with Willie? I think I wrote on his stomach once with a crayon. <laughs> I don't know if you call that a this love This is more scene. information than we need. <clears throat> no, 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 on camera. Oh, okay. <laughs> Woo. No, Willie and I are just friends. All right, how about Chris Christopherson? Chris Gustafson, I love. I adore him. He's a wonderful singer. He's a brilliant man. He's a great lyricist and a good actor. Been friends a long time. Your boyfriend in this movie, Walter Matthau. <laughs> Is he a good kisser? Oh, I, oh. <laughs> I didn't. He's he's good at everything he does, but I didn't concentrate on the kissing with Walter. I had I was laughing so much it was hard to keep my mouth closed. I know when Walter <laughs> when Walter whispers dirty things in your ears, it tears you up, doesn't he it? He does. Yeah. He's a he's a he's a naughty man sometimes. He's a naughty isn't he? boy, but I adore him. Uh, Jack Lemmon. He's such a gentleman. Uh, Jack's more quiet. Jack stands back and listens, but he's funny and he doesn't miss a trick. They're both professionals, you know. It was such a joy working with both of them because there's no comedy timing that's better in the world. Yeah, that's true. Warren Beatty. Oh, Warren is uh, the most meticulous. Uh, professional I've ever worked with. He sees every detail. He doesn't miss anything. He's a smart man. Uh, Burt Reynolds. Burt Reynolds uh, plays a good game of pool. <laughs> <laughs> what is your biggest complaint about men in general as someone who studies men for a living? The biggest complaint is that there's not more of them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. <clears throat> You're a naughty girl too, Diane. You know, I can I can tell that. H have you changed a lot from the time you hit Hollywood? Oh you know? my goodness, yes. I mean, were you more just were you ever naive? Were you ever naive? Oh, always. Always. Are you I still, still naive? I am naive. You want to go back to my room? No, <laughs> no, 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 no. Naive. You know, naive I think has a little bit to do with What's your definition, I Mine is, has a little bit to do with, not the dictionary definition, but just off the top of my head, always wanting to believe the best about someone or about okay. some situation. I think naive I was thinking about is not knowing when you're getting into some trouble. Oh. Yeah, sometimes I don't. Sometimes I don't. As a matter of fact, a dear friend of mine was telling me this morning about something she just got into with a guy where they were supposed to get married and living together and he signed a lease and then he said he didn't and I mean just getting into trouble when, when you when you when they say love is blind but I don't think real love is blind can you I tell when a man's lying to you are not you good always, at that not always but my instincts are better now yeah they're better now but I can't always tell because I want to believe yeah you want to think good things about yeah. people that's the only way to live in this business you yeah. have to be you have to always think there's a brighter day tomorrow yeah well even a brighter day today yeah why not today I don't want to wait until tomorrow heavens right now well, you're one of the great babes of all time. <laughs> I want to tell you that. Many an evening I've spent with Diane Cannon. Thank, Thank you. you so much. All right. Thank you. Thanks. Babes, that's a good